Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Mystic Mesa. My name is Stacy. I am joined in my office by my dogs Molly and Paige uh, and in my my world by Bad Pigeon Mom as well as all my dogs, my oh, Pegasus Poganip, my cat Sprink, uh, my chameleon Crayon, and my birds Tango and uh, Poco. I did not count you as one of my birds. You are just a visitor, Bad Pigeon Mom. Uh, anyway, hi guys. So welcome to the episode. I am so excited for this episode because I finally had a chance to log in and do some meaningful construction uh, in this world. I'm going to show it off to you in this episode. Uh, I feel 100% better if you knew I had the flu for like... 12 days it was it was insane uh and then i was putting out my minecraft field trip series which like a lot of people seem to love i'm so happy so much work went into that series um the whole weekend i was kind of consumed by it and then um i'm going this is tonight's wednesday night and i am uh going to pax i'm going to oh wait wait don't look don't look don't look uh i'm i'm leaving for san antonio tomorrow for pax south i've had this trip planned for like probably like months and months like seven eight months um and then after that life goes back to normal i don't have any trips coming up i have just lots of time to work on mystic mesa so uh i got really inspired i was watching like youtube and i realized something really fundamental that i don't think i've ever realized which is i prefer my houses to be five blocks tall as you can see this is four blocks tall and that's fine because this is a hallway uh but when i was downstairs oh, you know what i need i need a backpack so bad but i need to put some stuff away so that i can actually uh, use my my inventory is just like full. I've got to get another backpack pretty pretty soon here um, Okay, let's put away some of our food stuff too um, Just jam all of this in here. No, not the wheat not the wheat not the eggs not the milk. Hi Molly uh, Okay, this 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 I need to go to the nether and get magma cream so that I can continue to um, I need to heal, what should I call it? My nether wolf. Molly, stop shaking your collar, please. Please. Uh, tools. That's where I want to put this thing. I don't even know what to do with that. Uh, okay. So, I realized I like, uh, houses that are five blocks tall. And so I was like, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm going to basically dig down my entire bottom floor of my house and make it five blocks tall uh and i think that the result is just everything i wanted it to be this house is like the vision that i initially had for this house is finally starting to make sense and i'm like you know what this is going to be an epic house like an epic base i'm probably still going to build a level up here because uh, I like this is not a, a good entrance i think what's eventually going to happen is i'm going to build some kind of like big structure here that is like part of the house and then you won't enter just through this like trap door uh, in fact i think because uh, i'm trying to figure out what to do with the kitchen because the kitchen's in kind of a weird i have no way to get to the kitchen like i either have to put like stairs somewhere uh, i might have the entrance to the house be like here and maybe there would be stairs off in like that direction that go to the other lower floor in the kitchen um, but anyway, I added a lot of paintings. I added, um, you know, the extra layer uh, of the house. And then I also just added some embellishments like these acacia logs, just making it what I've always dreamed it would be. And it was such a small change, but I think it really, really made a huge difference. So this is my new hallway. Uh, let me show you guys. Uh, let me show you guys around. Uh, first of all, here's a picture of Paige and Molly. You can't really make it out, but they're actually, we're in the Mesa. We're in Southern Utah. Um, here's my Once Upon a Mesa poster that's got the Mesa there. Uh, and I'm holding a book, so this is in my library. Hello, Crayon. Um, uh, yeah, okay, so let's see. I have a chest here. Not much else has changed in here. It's just, it looks better because of the five blocks I'm telling you if you're building in Minecraft stop 
what you're doing if you're building four blocks tall because five blocks just it just feels right <laughs> so uh this room i'm really happy about now look at this window look at my view um hello ribsy i've got the wolf rooms that we'll get to in a minute i've kind of like broken them down a bit hi paisley um molly milk toast my back door my bedroom has changed significantly i have sliding glass doors now and this is it you've got poco i've got some chests i've got sugar in case poco ever gets out and i need to bring him back i've got a picture of molly up here this is when we lived right by the hollywood sign the hollywood sign's like right there you can't really see it uh this is Paige looking out the window at the mesa uh, my bed i've repositioned over here wait until it's nighttime and i sleep in it because i'm telling you you fall asleep looking at the stars this way and then you wake up looking at the sunrise this way perfect um, yeah, I love it. I actually love it. I added a lot of skylights in here to make the room brighter. Hi, Tango. Um, and then I, I removed the water from Pearl's room. This is now what I need to work on. I decided to keep this open, uh, and I've got my five, like, my, my main pack, which is, like, Pearl, Atlas, Ribsy, Paisley, and Piper, who I still need to tame. So, sand for Pearl, um, I thought that this looked kind of cloud-like. Uh, this is just the quartz, um, pillars, I think. No, chiseled quartz. Um, I have all the, I have quartz. I have quartz for days. I need, I need iron for days, but I have quartz for days. Uh, ribsies, the pillars, because they're kind of like ribs. <laughs> you look so cute. Uh, we've got grass in Paisley's room. That was there before. I need to get some nice flowers for there. And then Piper's room, I need to do, like, cake or something. But there's still not enough light in here with the shaders. Um, but I kind of like the idea of it being sort of open so that all the wolves can, like, play together. And, um, yeah, that's about it. Uh, so then over here, I've added more skylights up here. And then this is just a random hallway that I have. I could build more rooms off of it. Hi, hi Hippocamp! I could build like a water slide down to Hippocamp or something. I don't know. Um, I need, you know, I'm sure I'm going to get so many more pets and things that I'll, I'll want to have rooms out here. I'll probably do something else with the other wolves. Um, maybe I'll make a room for like my golems to stay in so that Clay doesn't always have to stay out here uh, on the balcony. I'm so sorry. I mean, you're doing a good job. Uh, so anyway, I hope you guys like those changes i feel really good about it like that's that's basically what i did in like two hours maybe of just finally having time to just like log on while i was like watching some tv and stuff and and build um this i want to eventually have like there's a uh, what's the mod called there's a really cool oh bad pigeon mom don't go out did bad pigeon mom just oh no she's there um what's the mod called i think it's called garden stuff there's a really cool mod called Garden Stuff that adds like a lot of pots and planters and then in uh, Mr. Crayfish's furniture there's like um, cobblestone pathways you can add. So I've always wanted to do like some kind of really beautiful back patio with like fairy lights and pathways and flowers and planters. Um, that leads down to like where I'll have eventually like my my sheep pens and my pigs and rabbits and cows and then it'll go over to unicorn meadow um we'll build like a bunch of bridges ah i love it i hope you guys like it let me know what you think Ooh, that hallway is dark i did not realize this like things are actually just gonna spawn here in my house which would be like the worst thing ever <gasps> okay it's time to sleep and show you guys what i'm talking about you guys are going to love this uh, let's just get a few more torches in here. Uh, okay, I'm going to go to bed, and then I think I'm going to go over and work on like my, my farm a little bit for a second. Um, okay, watch what I'm talking about. Beautiful view of the night stars and the, and the trees in the sky, and then <gasps> sunrise. Ah, sunrise on the mesa. I'm going to go get Poganip, and we are going to ride... We are going to ride over to the Ugly River Village. Um, anyway, I feel great about my house. More improvements will come. 
and it'll just be as as good as as these improvements were Poganip, it's time to fly how have you been uh okay let's go over to the village um there's all these unicorns uh, oh look at my shadow i love it uh all these horses and unicorns i still need to get all the saddles from and move them over and i can't find my bookcase golem i'm pretty sure casey won which was surprising to me i thought it was going to be a lock-in for dewey uh, but i like casey um where is my oh there it is on the map oh we're in a ravine wait what is that Oh, Mesa Wool. Uh, oh my gosh, look at us. Look at us flying in this ravine. We are so cool. Uh, okay. Um, hello, Ostrich. Let me go ahead and land Pognip. Can I talk about something really quick? And I just flew up for no reason. I don't know why. Um, there were so many comments in the last episode that I really just know nothing about Pam's mod. Which I don't. I, I really don't. But this was, I thought, uh, th I thought this was, like, really funny. That apparently with all of these plants, you can just right-click them and harvest them without actually having to break them. And then you get, like, tons more food. Uh, I, I just, I'm a silly person. So I'm gonna have sandwiches pretty much forever. Um, goodness, some of them. This is a problem. I think there's a couple mods that I want to add, actually, um, to that have been like updated and stuff. Not really adding mods, like um, mods that have been updated, and then one mod in particular that uh, just got updated to one seven ten that I I wanted in this pack from the beginning, but I I never had it in because uh, it's not that it got updated. I think it's that it didn't have crafting recipes or something. Um, it's train craft, but anyway, uh, I think that someone was saying that there's a mod called like chunk loader or something that would allow me to, I need wheat, holy ender wolves, my goodness, um, that would allow me to have this chunk, this chunk is not that far from my house, uh, that would allow me to have this chunk loaded so that my crops would like continue to grow, see like none of my wheat has grown. Which is, I left all those seeds at home, didn't I? Um, none of my wheat has grown while I've been at my house, even though I was building for hours, you know what I mean? So, like, that's not, that's not good. We're gonna have to relocate my farm. Um, maybe we'll do that. Maybe we'll, like, take the crops that are the most important, like, the peanuts and, like, either, like, blackberries. And maybe we'll do a small, oh, here they are. I was researching them. See all the flower pots? Like all the different kinds? Oh, I can make, I didn't think I could make those in this mod. People have wanted me to make these. Oh my goodness, really? I can do that with unicorn meadow stuff. I didn't think you got those flowers when you broke them. Really? Okay, we'll try that out. I might putz around a little bit in my dinosaur area. See, I need these peanuts to grow pretty badly and I need wheat. Uh, cause I'm trying to get enough cake to tame Paisley. So I might sit here for a minute and, and work on some stuff. So I really want to have a dinosaur, but I know I'm, I'm not ready yet because I need to make like huge fenced areas. Um, what was I working on? What was I doing? Like putting relic scraps into, like into here with just like junk or something? Like relic scraps 17 relic scraps should I be putting in 17 relic scraps I'm not sure actually um, cow pet you can come with me still the prophecy I got a prophecy the, the prof stone tablet I really need to do more with fossils and archaeology but I'm actually afraid I'm gonna do something bad can I like right click this <gasps> whoa it's a painting. I think I knew that actually. Whoa. That's like a dinosaur in ice maybe or something? Wow. Okay. These are creepy. Do these mean something? I bet they do. A damaged zombie pigman figurine? I want to see this. Huh. Okay. You're cool. Um, another stone tablet it there oh see that progresses it <gasps> is it because i put it next to it is that is that a little dog it looks like a little dog almost like not a person 
Oh, that's the same? It's a different color. But it looks like it's the same. It's the same prophecy. Uh, all right. Let's go to Unicorn Meadow, I guess. This is such a bummer with the... Um, in regards to the wheat. Like, wheat is just such a dumb thing. I... Oh, I, yeah. I need to fence it off and everything because... You should be, like, good for something, sir. Watermelon and chicken. You guys are good for nothing. Um, because I'd love to have villagers. Is there a mod? Do you guys know of a mod where, um, you could, like, have villagers that actually do stuff for you? You know what I mean? I guess I have, like, the fairies in the candy aisle that can... Farm. I think they can farm wheat. I've never had a series where, like, I remember when I first started Dogcraft, I had a massive wheat farm, um, and it was like floating. I don't know if you guys remember that, but I just got completely turned around and was going the wrong way. Um, but I haven't had a need in like any of my Minecraft series really to have like a ton of resources, um, like just random things like I do in Mystic Mesa so I definitely need to come in I need magma cubes I need to go back to the nether I have I have a lot to do um why are we coming over here oh just to get a clover crown I guess so I mean I guess that's exciting right I didn't think you could break these things I thought that they just disappeared when you broke them oh no you can't get them okay so we need um we need eight. Holy cow! Yeah! Puck! What? Why? What? Oh my gosh! You're a monster! Okay, hold on. Let me... <coughs> I like... I, I thought my voice was back. Poganip, get out of here. Get out of here. Unicorn guard! Like, explain yourself. He killed a unicorn! Unicorn Meadow is supposed to be like this beautiful place! And I got a guard for the unicorns and he murdered one! This is... This is unexpected! Wow! Okay! I'm, I'm scared to like leave him! I'm, I'm terrified! Okay. Wow. Wow. That was that was unexpected. That was um Gosh, I didn't expect that. See, there's another unicorn right over here, but I don't want to bring them over to Unicorn Meadow now because I don't know what's going on. I that maybe the Oh, there's a, a nest here. I want to check the egg for a phoenix egg. Uh maybe there's some like way that the unicorn provoked it or something. A kiwi egg. Kiwis are cute. We don't have a kiwi, but we saw one once. I need to get my aviary going. Um, I cannot even believe that that just happened. I really can't believe that that just happened. Uh, okay, let's go back home and sleep, Poganip. Aqua Creeper, I hate you guys. You make it impossible for me to ride my hippocamp. Uh, okay, let's- oh wait, we have a crafting table here now. Convenient. Uh, let's make a clover crown. You know, I'm really sorry because there are people telling me I could do this from the beginning and I was like, I don't have that mod. I don't even know what mod this is. Oh! I'm beautiful! Oh, I've always wanted one of these! I feel like Lizzie! Oh, I, I, I just didn't think I would ever have a clover crown in Minecraft. I thought I wasn't cool enough. Um, anyway. Hi, Hippocamps. I kind of want to take one of you out for a spin because it's been a while. Um, oh, are you not tamed? Oh, you're not tamed. Ow! Yeah, you're not tamed. Okay, that's fine. This, um, oh, Malachite. Yes, you are tamed. Let's go. Oh, look at, look at me. Look at me go in my flower crown. Uh, you know what would be cool? I wonder if we build like a bigger water kind of moat here 
if, um, I wonder if Aqua Creepers would spawn or not. And can I, like, outswim an Aqua Creeper? Uh, we're gonna find out. We are gonna find out. Malachite, I don't want to kill you. I might kill you. Um, this is cool. This is so cool. We're going so fast. Look at you, buddy. Look at you. Uh, yeah, I think we can out swim. Oh, there's a bird over there that I've never- No, there! Okay, now we're gonna find out! Now we're gonna find out! Okay, we've got three aqua creepers on our trail, but we can out swim them. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Look at that! We're so much faster than them! This is genius! I had no idea! I really want to go over and see that bird, though. Oh, there's so many aqua creepers. Um, okay, I'm just gonna go. Oh, I wasn't even sprinting. Now I'm going even faster. This is amazing. It's a swan. There's swans. Oh, I'm coming back for you guys. Aviary. Aviary has to start. I've got. I'm, it's swimming with swans. Wait a minute. And you're one of those white pigeons that I want. Ooh. Ah. Oh. Thrilling. Thrilling. Just thrilling. Oh my gosh, I love you. And some mermaid wolves, but the swans. I really like the look of this pigeon. More so than bad pigeon mom. Um, I've got a tame cake wolf so that I can I can have her. Hello, ocean wolves. Look at this. I don't know if I've, have I seen a swan yet in this series? Oh, I want a swan. I want a swan so bad. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh, I love them. Oh, I want swans in my garden. It's gonna be perfect. And I really like you. Don't go anywhere, okay? I have a mate for you. It's gonna be great. Uh, Malachite? <sighs> Malachite. Hi. Oh, okay, buddy. All right. Um, guys, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and end this now because I have a very early flight. But I hope you enjoyed this episode of Mystic Mesa. And, uh, I hope you guys are excited for the future! Sorry, that was really, I was, I was really excited. Anyway, I'm going to go to bed. I'm going to try to go to bed. Uh, I have lots of energy. But until next time, Paige and Molly love you. Go rescue a dog.